Here is the cube from the previous step with two holes in running entirely through the cube. We are now going to use a different method to create a hole from the top face running vertically down through the, the cube. We are going to use a dedicated hole tool here in the right feature toolbar. The dashboard opens across the top of the screen waiting for us to select the surface that we want the hole to be placed on. We want it on the top surface and we'll need the datum planes to be displayed for this. You'll notice that the hole has two green diamonds. We need to drag each one of these green diamonds onto a piece of geometry to create an offset for the centre of the hole. So I'm dragging the first green diamond to the front datum plane and that's created an offset here from that datum plane which I double click, type in a new number in this case 0, press enter on the keyboard and it will pull that across in a moment. I drag the other green diamond drag handle to the right datum plane, release the mouse and change this offset also to zero. That locates the center of the hole coincident with these two datum planes i.e. in the center of the block. We want the diameter of the hole to be eight and the only other thing we need to change is the depth of the hole. Currently it's set by a drag handle. Just like we did with the extrude, we want to change the known depth here to drill to intersect with all surfaces. That will take the hole through the bottom. Preview it with the spectacles button. And we can see the hole runs through the centre of the object. The green check mark completes the feature and places that new hole feature at the bottom of the model tree. Turn off the display of datum planes change to a pictorial view, in this case trimetric, and make sure we save our work prior to the next step.